So here's the thing. I have an exam tomorrow, an exam the day after, a paper due tomorrow, a little worksheet due tomorrow, a quiz due the next day, a quiz due the next day, a lot of homework on top of all of that. I started studying for the exam I have tomorrow today. Simply did not have time to do it till today because I have been doing homework all weekend for stuff that was due today. I'm wildly unprepared for this exam tomorrow. In order to be prepared, I'm going to be waking up at 5 a.m. Is this something that I want to do? No. Is it something that has to be done? Yes. Tomorrow, I have my 8 a.m. So I figured this gives me about two hours to get studying in, maybe get a little homework done, but I feel like that's all I'm gonna wanna focus on until then. I don't have any coffee in my home, but I have this, what I thought was like the Starbucks matcha ended up I bought it. It's like the Tazo Tazo brand. It's not the Starbucks matcha. I made a TikTok reviewing it and I was like, wow, this like tastes nothing like the matcha from Starbucks. And this girl that works at Starbucks commented on it and was like, yeah, we use actual matcha powder. That's not what we use. And I was like, oh, cool. So I have that. Not exactly delicious. It's just not amazing it tastes like a green apple mixed with oat milk that i drink and i've been having it every week so i just don't want to waste it so i'll probably have that tomorrow morning just to give me a little pick me up so i'm gonna go to bed so that i'm ready for a really crazy day and what's okay what is i filmed like about a week ago a video just like this saying the exact same thing and i didn't i couldn't do it when my alarm went off at five i was like the hell i am not doing that but tomorrow, because I have an exam, like I feel like it actually has to be done. So for now, I'm gonna go to bed. Good night. I do not wanna do this, but it has to be done. Now it's time to go to my 8 a.m. I think I got some good studying in this morning. Haven't had any caffeine yet. I'm definitely very tired. I was like looking over my little study guide one more time and I was like trying not to fall asleep. And I have to say, the thing that sucks most about having all this work, it's not the fact that I'm so stressed I have raging heartburn. It's not the fact that I'm losing sleep and getting like five to six hours of sleep a night. It's not the fact that I literally have never had so much work and studying to do in my life. It's the fact that I've missed the last two episodes of The Last of Us and I feel like I'm missing out and all I wanna do <laughs> is lay in bed and watch the last two episodes because I keep on seeing little clips on TikTok and I don't want to get any like crazy spoilers, but I just saw another one. So I feel like I already know what happens, but like I really want to watch it because it looks so, oh, so dang good. But for now we're off to my first class where I have an exam. Wish me good luck, I'll see you after. Okay, my first class is done. She did lecture after our exam. That kind of sucked. That's okay though. Um, the exam was definitely harder than expected. Not sure how well I did on it. Now I am off to my second class, which is farm. And then I'll be in there after because I have another class right after. Wow. All right little change of plans. Just walked back from the library where I feel like I got just about nothing done. I was there for an hour and a half maybe. All I could think about was food and I left my lunch bag in my car. Don't know why I did that. So then I finished the assignment that was due tonight, started studying for the first time for my exam tomorrow. Super silly idea to do that because now I feel incredibly unprepared. 
It's actually five till five. It is 4.55, meaning I've officially been up for 12 hours. And I'm not sure if it's because I'm always tired these days, but I really don't feel that different. Like I don't feel that tired. Or maybe I'm just so like stressed right now that I'm just a little wired right now. I don't know. I mean, that totally could change by the time it hits nine. Like I could be like totally crashing, but I'm also really tired at nine usually. I don't know. There's just a lot going through my brain right now. I realized how unprepared I am for the exam tomorrow and now I'm stressing, but it's like I there's nothing I could have done about it because every second of my free time I've spent it doing homework and then I feel bad. So I'm walking back to my car, right? There's this girl and so there's a tree right here and there's like a girl and she looks like she's talking to someone, right? She's like giggling, like looks like she's explaining something. Well, I walk, you know, I'm walking past the tree. There's no one there and I was like, okay, I talk to myself too sometimes. And she looks at me and she says, you're really pretty. And I think she was talking to me. I don't think she was talking to the imaginary friend. So I turn around and I say, thank you. But for some reason, I'm overthinking the way that I said, thank you. I feel like I said, thank you in a way, like people randomly tell me I'm pretty all the time, which like does it, that's not true. But like, I feel like I should have said, thank you. Like more like I was thankful. Like, I feel like I was just, I was just like, thank you. Like, like I hear it all the time. But I should have been like, oh my gosh, that's like such an amazing compliment. Thank you. I don't even know if you were talking to me or your imaginary friend, but she made eye contact with me. Oh my God, I'm like, eye contact with me. I need to slow down. So I think she was talking to me. I don't know. Anyways, all I could think about was food at the library and I kept on getting distracted. Like I'm having a tough time focusing and I wanted to go home, but then I realized I have a study group in an hour, not enough time to go home. Then I was like, well, I could not go to the study group. But then I figured if I didn't have any focus at the library, I wouldn't have any focus at home either. So now I'm not really sure what to do. No, I know what I'm gonna do. So, okay, so I walked back to my car so that I could drive it to the parking lot right next to the library. I parked it in this one because it's right, it's the parking lot, like gym parking lot, gym parking lot. And I had planned on going to my spin class, which I always go to on Mondays which I still could go to, but I just feel like I'm so stressed and hungry that I'm not really gonna be focused. Also, I passed out um, on Friday, so I'm a little paranoid of doing that again. So because I'm hungry, I'm scared I'm gonna pass out during my spin class because it's a little intense. So I just have all these thoughts running through my brain right now. And I feel like the thing I need to do is just take a chill pill, eat my dinner. I'm gonna, we're gonna start, I'm, just, I'm gonna eat my dinner. But I feel like I need to be eating. I mean, I am eating. Um, studying while I'm eating. Because I feel like I'm just wasting my time right now just ranting to you. But so, uh, I'm going to go to the library. To the library to eat. Okay. As you can see, it's dark now. It's currently 8. So I've officially been on campus for 12 hours. But this is usually how my Mondays go anyways. So that's okay. I have to say, considering waking up at 5.30, I'm not as tired as I would expect myself to be. I could just be kind of stressed about having the exam tomorrow, but I'm not feeling all that scared. No, I am feeling all that scared. I'm not feeling all that tired. Is this something that I want to do every day? Probably not. The only thing that I don't think I would do again is, unless I had a test, I would do. But I don't, if I had 8 a.m.s every day, I don't really think it's worth it to wake up because I really only had an hour and a half, which is a lot of time. But for me, like I need a solid like two to three hours to do homework. An hour and a half just doesn't cut it. For my lifestyle, it's definitely not something that I could do every single day all the time, especially, especially weekends. Like this is not something that I could do weekends. The day has felt long. Like I do have to say, 5 a.m. when I was doing homework feels like forever ago. Like I was on my phone and I went to my camera roll and I saw the video of me studying this morning and like I thought it was from yesterday because that's how long ago it felt. Okay, well, I'm gonna turn this on so I can say bye. Um, I couldn't get it. Okay, thanks so much for watching. Please like and subscribe. Bye.